What's up, YouTube? It's BNSX6419 first. Awesome videos here. And today we're doing the covered hopper tutorial. This is part of rolling stock. So for the wheels, we're going to need gray concrete, polished blackstone stairs, polished blackstone slab, stone button, dark oak trap door. And we also brown concrete. Dark oak stairs. Dark oak slab. And and also a dark oak fence. So that's facing our wheels. You can remove this to because I'm gonna make these first. Then you can place the wheel back in the spot. But you do need back to back polished blackstone stairs. After, after our wheels have been placed, then add a 2x5 of dark oak slab. And you want to have 23 blocks long. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. Let's do the same thing we did to the front. Add the same slabs, which is a 2x5. So we're going to place in our, our back wheels. Same thing before I add the wheels, but I like to add these back to back posh black stone stairs. So, guys, rail cars are part of rolling stock. So, guys, if you want to know about a covered hopper, I'll send you a link to go to Wikipedia. <clears throat> that will explain to you about covered hoppers. Alright, so you'll need 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5 polished black. No, no, no. Brown, con brown concrete. Skip 2. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Skip 2. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Now we can add in the slabs. Now let's do the same thing on the other side. Let's get five. Yeah, same thing that we did on the other side. Now let's add these little let's add these hatches below. Add three of these. Make sure it's away from the wheel. I always like to add these back to back. Before I like to add the wheels, I always like to add these back to back stairs. Seems they're both upside down. For guys, for the yellow, we're going to be using birch slab. Whereas I like to skip three.
course, I like to add the yellow first before I add the rest. I like to use this for like the yellow color. So guys, we could probably add the fence. These two by three dark oak fence. Let's make a two by two on this side. Make it like a is that a, a white stained glass pane? We don't need gray concrete because that was for our wheels. Let's take three brown concrete. And we can have stairs going down like this. Let's do the same thing on the back. Yeah, same thing in the back. Oh yeah, guys, I should probably add in this the inner part of the yellow. It almost looks like a stripe color. Yeah. Three dark oak slabs. So guys, for rolling stock, before I add the wheels, I would have to add these back-to-back -back stairs. So guys, you can... <coughs> cover hoppers can actually haul it such as grain, dry cement, and sand. I think buffer cars usually haul sand. I'm going to search farmland. We're actually going to need a uh, white stained glass pane. Because I'm using I am using oh yeah dark oak trap door that's for the brake wheel This will be slightly different. Of course, facing the front. We're facing the front, which will be a dark oak stairs. Because you want this facing the front, and you why you want five, five black con brown concretes, and three on top. Three, three white stained glass panes, as we don't need dark oak trap door because that was our brake wheel. That can be like the name. Guys, we'll want another brick slab. Yeah, another brick slab to be our coupling. Guys, I like to use another brick slab for the coupling. I'll 
also want two white stained glass panes and a dark oak stairs. Yeah, two by two by three, another uh, dark oak fence. Make this a two by three. Leave this gap here for a white stained glass pane for the white stained glass pane. You can make this a 2x3. Just add 5 in the bottom. Guys, I'll find white concrete for like our BNSF number and logo. So we'll probably don't need polished blackstone stairs. And that's where it says BNSF.
Yeah, that's right. Let's So guys, for the top, we're gonna find one iron trap door. Now let's keep adding the rest of the back. So guys, for the top, we're using dark oak slab for like these little round hatches. Skip three, because skip four. Yeah, same thing. Skip four. thing I should probably do is probably add do not hammer so it's like between Probably like somewhere between this third slab. Alright guys, that's pretty much it. How to build the BNSF covered hopper. This this oh yeah, guys, I forgot. I was checking. That's pretty much it. How to build the BNSF covered hopper that can transport dry cement, grain, and sand. Alright, so thank you so much for the all and love support, and thank you so much for watching this video. Be sure, tell me what you think of this covered hopper, just drop your comments below. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Just stay tuned for the, the ES44AC 2003 edition. We'll catch you next time. Peace.